Hello, Jungle Explorer here, and today I'm going to be talking about my favorite little 9mm pistol. This is the uh, Versa Thunder 9, made in Argentina. It's a, a sweet little gun. Um, I bought this in 2008 and uh, just really fell in love with it. Uh, I didn't have a lot of cash. I was looking for something um, a little uh, on more budget friendly than your more expensive brands. And so I saw this and I liked the way it looked. I bought it, I took it home, tested it out at the range and just fell in love with it. Uh, several things that I like about the Bursa Thunder 9. Number one, the grip. It's just one of the best grips, uh, factory grips that I've, I've felt. Um, my son is one of those change pistols every month pe person. He, he buys a pistol, loves it for a couple of weeks. Then he finds something he thinks he wants better. He trades it off, sells, and so he's, he's always trading pistols. And he's gone through probably 10 different 9 millimeters. Um, and I've tried them all. He's had CZs and Berettas and and uh, Smith and Wessons and things like that and and so I just keep coming back to this I found one gun I really like that you see how thick the uh, the pistol grip is on it here it just really is a thick one um, I've got pretty big hands to look at that it just fills my hand up it's kind of a, a, a non uh, slick rubberized grip with a lot of a lot of grip to it has even some some uh, ridging up here for grip um, so that's that's the main thing you can really hold this pistol good it has a really good sight picture if you look down the barrel of it it just uh, I mean the front sight fills the back side up just perfectly uh, it's got a little white on it and so you can just really it's got a great sight picture you can really hold this gun steady just uh, just rock steady shoot with it um, it's easy to, to get a sight picture with this thing the Bursa did a really good job. It comes with a little accessory rail already on the gun. You wanted to add like a red laser or something to it. I don't care much for those things, but uh, you could do that. Uh, let's talk about its functions. You know, um, it's got an ambidextrous decocker on it. So, uh, you know, if you've got it and you're, you're done shooting, you don't want to shoot, you don't have to, you know, you can do that or you can decock it. All right, so, you know, and that's another thing I like about it. It has a hammer on it so that if you, you, you don't, you can leave it uncocked and you're ready to go. Okay, but the, uh, the decocker acts as a, as a slide lock. So when it's like that, you can't, you can't cock it. And it also keeps you from cocking it like that. So it can't be cocked. So that's your safety on this thing is your, is your decocker. So ambidextrous decocker. For left-handed, right-handed, and it provides uh, as a safety. You know, there's a lot of guns. I like this gun because it has the, the hammer on it. So if I need it in a quick situation, instead of having to lose a, a shell that's already in the chamber, I can just cock it. Um, you know, so it's just really good to operate like that. Um, it feels real solid. It's a solid piece of machinery here. I've shot, I don't know how many rounds through it, uh, you know, 1,000 rounds. It show no signs of wear. It's like brand new. Um, you got 17 round clips that come with it. Um, I it came with two of them. It's easy to just it's really smooth operating. Uh, you know, like that. Now on the trigger, I'm gonna drop the clip here out like that. Um, on the trigger here, it has got a really sweet trigger. It's got a little bit of a of a pull to it. Not much, I'm sure that could be adjusted, but it comes from the factory with it. Just, I mean, it's just super, maybe two pound trigger pull. It's real light. Um, you just really draw down on something and bam, you know, you can really aim with it, hit good. I'm not the greatest pistol shooter in the world. Uh, my grandfather was a championship pistol shooter. I just didn't inherit none of his, his skill. But I'm gonna take it over to the range and uh, give it a little bit of few rounds on a little pistol target I have over there and see how she goes. Okay, so I've loaded 10 rounds into my Bursa Thunder 9, ready to go. And uh, got a pistol target up there. And we'll see. Kind of shoot 
If I shoot the two bottom ones, they should go flip to the top. Well. I've got a defect with my my target over here. My paddle keeps flying off. Anyways, saw it shoot. I'm not the best pistol shot in the world, but I hit it a few times. Um, Burst of Thunder 9. Beautiful pistol here. Um, just something you should consider if you're on a budget and you need a really good pistol that really feels well, shoots well, just all around decent pistol for a, a really awesome price. Uh, I would not shy away from the Bursa Thunder 9. Um, it's my favorite 9mm that I've held so far. And uh, you give it a try, it might be yours. Well, that's the end of my review here. So if you've enjoyed it and uh, found it helpful, please like, subscribe, and comment. Until next time, Jungle Explorer signing out.